New at noon, a young couple is going to prison for a long time for their part in a racially charged crime. A judge sentenced the defendants in the last 90 minutes. Channel 2 Steve Gelbach is live at that courthouse in Douglasville. And Steve, this was an emotionally charged hearing. In all my years of covering courts, this was probably one of the most intense hearings, court proceedings I've ever had to witness with two mothers, one of the defendants on one side and one of the victims on the other side, both addressing each other in court. Now, Jose Torres and Kayla Norton, in tears most of the hearing, were each given a year longer in prison than the state even was seeking, 13 years for Torres, six for Norton. The judge called their actions a hate crime and racially motivated. The couple, parents to three children between them, were part of a larger group on July of 2015 called Respect the Flag. They were rallying in a convoy of their trucks, flying the Confederate battle flag, pulled up to a birthday party for an eight-year-old black child. They were found guilty of yelling racial slurs, threatening to kill partygoers, even the kids, and Torres of pointing his shotgun at them. Here's a little of that exchange when Kayla Norton stood up to speak and the victim's reaction. And out of the more than a dozen people originally involved in this, only four were charged with felonies here. Two of them are now serving prison sentences, much shorter prison sentences than both Torres and Norton. I'll play more of those emotional exchanges and hear what Norton said to her family as she was being led away in handcuffs. I'll have that part of the story on Channel 2 Action News starting at 4 p.m. Live in Douglas County, Steve Gelbach, Channel 2 Action News.